Hey guys. Um, mm, I have a lot weighing on my mind today. It's Friday. And um, something that I've been wanting to talk about for some time is, um, and you know, and this is coming to you as a live testimony here because I've lived it. I've done it. And we're going to talk about teen pregnancy, um, pregnancy in general, um, for everybody out there. Because first I want to say, again, I've lived it. I've done it. I know what you're doing. So stop. Mm, just stop. Um, I had babies when I was in my teens. I had babies when I was in my 20s. I had a baby when I was in my 30s, okay? I've lived it. I know it. I know what you're doing, okay? And it doesn't work. Let me explain. Ladies, if you think that it's, that it's going to keep the man in your life by having babies, you're wrong, okay? The stats are there. I've seen it. I've lived it again. Okay, I know. Um, and I'm telling you, I'm here to tell you, only 20%, 20%, the stats are there, of teen fathers marry the mother. Okay? Marry the mother. 20%. That's a very, very, very little small portion. Okay? So, if you think having a baby is going to keep the man in your life, think again because it's not happening. No, it's not. It's not. It's not happening. Okay. Again, I've lived it. I've done it. I am not perfect. Oh God, by far, I'm not perfect. I am not perfect. Um, I was one of those that said, hmm, no. I know better. I know more than what my mom and dad are trying to tell me. Oh, just like you. Yeah. You can't wait to get to the magic number of 18 because, oh, God, 18 is a magic number, right? Wrong. Okay. I'm here to tell you just stop. Stop. It's not cute. It's not cute when I see that. You had your first baby, and then you're having another baby, and then, God forbid, I see that hmm, you're complaining because you can't take care of the first one you have, and then you're having another one because you think it's cute. It's not cute. It's not. Mm -mm. It's not cute. No. It weighs on my mind because, you know, I was there. I've done it. And I'm telling you, it, it doesn't, it doesn't get better. I had opportunities to be at home, just like you, I'm sure. Be at home, they told me. You know, you can stay here as long as you want. Don't have to pay no bills. Further your education. Go to school. Do this, do that. And mm, I didn't do it. Because I was one of the smart ones. I was, I was, I knew more. I knew more than my mom and dad. Um... I decided that I was going to have babies because, well, I mean, everybody else was doing it and it was, it was the trend, I guess you could say. And, and I knew more than what everybody was telling me and I had my babies and God forbid, I love my babies. Oh, I love my babies and they're doing great. And did you, you know, but I gave up a lot, a lot in life. I did. I gave up a lot in life. Um, you know, it took me a long time before I could go back to school and do what I wanted to do. I put a lot of my time um, on the back. I sacrificed. I went without so that I could give to my kids. And I'm not saying that you're not going to do the same thing, okay? I'm not. But you know what? I'm here to tell you right now. Stop. Enjoy your life because you're only young ones. And I, you know, you're only young ones. Enjoy your life. Go out, have vacation, spend time, you know, with friends, enjoy your, your trips, do everything. Because when you have a child, it changes because the friends that you had that don't have babies, the majority of them are not there no more. Okay. They're not, they're out, they're having fun. They're going to the beach. They're, they're going vacation. They're having fun with their friends. They're going here. They're going there and they done forgot about you. They forgot about you, okay? So don't do it. Don't do it. 
don't be one of those that fall into the trap of having a baby. Guys, guys, I'm here to tell you, listen up, get smart. Women are evil too, okay? They're going to tell you that they're taking birth control and they're doing this and that. And then the next thing you know, you're stuck. You're ha you have a child now with this person forever. And it's a lifelong commitment. I'm telling you, it's a lifelong commitment. It's not that you can just have a baby. And it's, that's it. It doesn't work like that. You don't have to believe everything that the woman tells you. Okay, still take precaution. Because they're, they're out there. I'm a woman. I know I'm trying to tell you this. Okay? I see it every day. I see it every day. I see it every day. Guys fighting for their rights to see their children because they have babies with just anybody. Stop. Live your life. Enjoy your life. Be young. Enjoy it. Go out and have fun. If you, you know, get married, enjoy the first few years of your marriage before you bring children into it. Because later on in life, you're going to appreciate it a lot differently. Okay? So just stop. Stop. Because it's not, it's not cute. I'm so tired of seeing, you know, girls getting pregnant and teens getting pregnant and, and thinking that it's okay. It's not to stop enjoy your life and be well have babies later so not only you can appreciate it but they can appreciate it too because their life is going to be so much better okay that's all have a good day